there's a lot more starter objects than just the regular um, objects right here um, with an add-on that comes with Blender. So if I go into Edit, Preferences, and I go down to my add-ons and type in Extra, there's two add-ons that come with Blender called Extra Objects, so you don't have to download these. I just enable them both, one's for curves and one's for mesh uh, data. Um, just save the preferences and close that. Now when we hit Shift A and go to Mesh, we have all these things. So, um, I mean, there's a lot to explore. I encourage you just to go through and see what there is. So single vert is really cool. Uh, round cube. Like we'll just we'll just click through a, a few of them. So uh, torus objects. So we've got some uh, interesting things here. And then the settings. You know, we can access all the settings right here. If you accidentally click off. For any reason, you can press F9 to bring this up again, unless you like click something or do a function, then it's you know kind of gone forever. Um, but what else have we got? So, um, you know, Taurus knots, we've got some pretty cool knot things and change the type there, absolutely insane. Um, let's see, we have math functions, so uh, yeah, if you into this stuff. <laughs> I'm not. Um, got a triangle. We can. I, I don't know. Like cool, whatever. Let's let's see some others. So, um, so the gear is actually really cool. So it's just like a gear generator. You can do all kinds of stuff with it. Um, so that's that's really nice. What else we have? Let's screw the worm thing. Worm. <laughs> Didn't know it was called worm. But anyway, so. That's helpful as well. A noteworthy one is the wall factory. So just generating walls is a thing. So the lazy, this is the lazy add-on right here. Um, so yeah, just mess with all these settings. I'm sure there's uh, tutorials online about, you know, what you can do with all this stuff. There's some just crazy, crazy stuff you can do with this. Um... Yeah, and, you know, just keep going down. There's all these, like, extra shapes and things. So, really cool stuff. And, yeah, don't forget the there are curve objects as well. So, if I go down and add a curve, we have all these to add as well. Um, yeah, take some time and just explore these because there's some great starter shapes for you. So, instead of having to model things yourself, you can you know, have a really great starting point. Like, I've used this curve... Uh, the curve spirals um, a few times so where this will generate a uh, so it'll, it'll generate like you know a spiral and do all kinds of stuff with it so you know drinking that I actually use this to help make a Christmas tree once that's fun anyway so yeah check those out have fun exploring that and remember the F9 button and uh yeah, enjoy. See what there is. Thanks for your time and consider subscribing. See ya.